Now let's talk about the most basic type of normalization or image pre-processing, which is done before a training a deep learning model. In PyTorch, we use the torch vision, the transform dot normalize to normalize the images before being fed into the deep learning model for training. So in a very short way, what normalize does is it takes two parameters, which is the means and STD, meaning that the standard deviation and mean is the average. So it simply taking the input of like each channel and uh, subtracting it from the mean, which is given and dividing everything by the standard deviation, which is also given. And that is the output of the channel. So let's see what it does in uh, like, you know, in a brief manner. So here we imported uh, Torch Vision. Uh, sorry, we imported transform from Torch Vision and imported CV2 because we're going to read a test image. So the test image here is of a like, you know, random image that I found in Google. So I imported this and I'm using this specific like four transforms to normalize the image. The first, we uh, transfer, transform the image to a pill image and resize it to 20, 224 by 224 because it's the like the general size of all pre-chain models. And uh, normally they take in, in the shape of 224 by 224 pixels. The image should be in this shape. So we resize it then we convert it to tensors uh, and then we normalize it. This here is the mean of three channels that we want. And this here is the standard deviation of what we want. So next, let's just uh, read the image. Also, uh, one more thing is that the normalize function of the like, you know, transform uh, does uh, cannot take in images. The, the images need to be converted to tensors. That's why we convert it to tensors before being like, you know, fed into the normalize uh, function. Okay, let's moving on. So this is uh, just, we're just reading the image and we can just see the image in here. As you can see, it's just 225s and stuff because like most of the color here is white. So that's why we can see like all three channels being 225. Uh, next, we apply the transforms and we see the image. As you can see the all of the 225s became one because uh, the all of the values of this image has been normalized. And so these, uh, this image is ready to be fed into the neural network, either for training or for inference. That's all.